This is Andrew Alafante with Surf and Turf Roofing, performing a digital roof analysis at 40 East New York Avenue in the Villas, New Jersey. Now, guys, I'm up on your roofing system here to inspect the overall integrity, and I know you guys were looking at a repair for that heater stack over there, but upon my initial inspection, this entire roofing system does need to be replaced as soon as possible, like yesterday. And these are the exact reasons why. And the first issue I noticed as I came up here was that you actually have two layers of roof on this roofing system. You can see if I lift these shingles up, you can see the other layer down underneath there. What this is doing is causing a serious amount of weight to sit on this roof, and in consequence, water's gonna get trapped up in between those two layers and cause mold and mildew like I showed you in the attic video. Now this is something we wanna get on right away, so I'm glad you called me out when you did so I can show you how we can help you. Now the next issue I noticed as I came up here was the amount of rotted plywood on this lower slope section here. You can see that this is actually a dip. And if I take my foot and I place it on here, you can see, you can hear that it's actually crunching under my foot. But what's causing this is there's not enough waterproofing membrane on this lower sloped area. And as a consequence, you're seeing this water run down this slope as well as this valley get caught up in all this debris and start to rot the decking out underneath here. You can see I did my digital moisture meter here. And if I place it on the, the slope of your roof, it's reading 0%. That's awesome. I come down here right to this valley, starts to read 20% moisture. And if I take it even farther down, it starts to read 35% moisture. This is telling me that there's a ton of moisture getting up underneath there. And at 15%, mold and mildew starts to breed and seriously can have serious health issues if we don't get on this. Now, if I come down to the eave here, you can actually see the amount of rotted plywood that you're incurring on this roof. Now, the worst problem overall is the severe lack of ventilation in this roofing system. And what's causing this is the, the uh, no ridge vent being installed on this roof or any attic fans or any ventilation, period. And that's actually what's causing all of these issues combined. And it was accompanied with the two layers. It's starting to granulate these shingles at a rapid rate as well as break down. And this is gonna cost you nothing more than thousands of dollars of interior damage. So what James and I are gonna do is we're gonna get down, formulate a plan to get this entire roofing system secure as soon as possible.